<laughs> we picked a good day to come to London, Dara, mm. didn't you? <laughs> Watch out, Darren. Oh, the beautiful people of London. Shoot a life, not a knife. L5 alive. Gonna bomb you, sir. Thank you. Yeah, it's all gonna be a lot. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Wow. What's going to come to deal with the crowd if we get out of control? We've got the redhead, he's the man that coordinates it. This is the main one, the one with the red on him. Give it. Right, so although it's good, and although there's a lot of activity, there's no leadership. Right. So as you can see, the reason why everyone's doing it, the police are starting to respond. The police are starting to respond in an aggressive manner. This is what's going on now. How do you go home? But it is the Cajun people in. Like fully automatic. So we're the Ampere people outside Buckingham Palace. Feeling absolutely fantastic. I don't know why. But I'm just feeling fantastic. destination just stepping in i'm in the famous sean atwood's <laughs> true crime podcast room how about that there's the painting on the back there there's sean you okay sean just getting the gopro ready for day of filming there's the man himself looks like he's tiddling my head <laughs> well there you go people i'm here Another stage of the journey, on to London. So basically, got the new flyers. Sean's helping me get down to London. Sean's helping me deliver the message, which is a bonus. And this is Darren's fourth visit to London. I know. No, it's about me third. Third? Yeah, so my first one, we were in a, it's like six of us in a Rover for tests, a Rammer. We just bombed down from Liverpool down here. On had a, a little mooch. On a mission? Grafton. Found two cafes with fruit machines in. Kicked them in. You only good on the fruit machines? Got the coins. Got the coins out the fruit machines. <laughs> had them in the bitch of the car in socks. As we're flying back home, we get pulled. Did by you? By police, yeah. We're took into custody. With your pound coins? With the pound coins and they release us. <laughs> they release us because they made me pour to stop yeah, them and give just, us the money back. It's not evidence against your pound that? coins, is it? What's that? They only gave us it because we could divide the coins up and we'd have something like £210 each or something. Yeah. <laughs> that was the first time I was in London. Second time. I was so did you use box. a tool to get it out or did you just kick the machine in? Because oh, you can get You used to go in with a nice strong screwdriver on the old fruit machine. It's called ping, pop, pop. Bring the tubes out, tubes into a sock, gone. <laughs> Not bad. <laughs> What's that here? Quite a close. Park Lodge. Park Lodge. Apartments. So it's all about this protest. Apparently so. And that fair up there. It's like, it sounds like a rave, doesn't it? Here's the police horses. So something must be coming along. Yep. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, a little squizzer. Squizzer, not as chubby as mine. <laughs> little squizzer. Yeah, thanks for my bloody £10 Brazil nuts. Yes! <laughs> <laughs> Starving squirrel. Look at the demons on them. <laughs> See the demon on the back? Yeah, 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 yeah. 
Can you see that on that camera? I don't know if it goes that close, but we can see some of it. That's cool, isn't it? There's more artwork over there, them big, two big heads over there. See them? With holes oh, in the head. Yeah, yeah. Be bosh little pictures look, there, look, look at the big heads. Yeah, let's get close to the horses. Yeah, let's freak the horses out. <laughs> joke! Joke! Oh, he's gonna run in front of him, right? <laughs> yeah, yeah, all good. Can I hold it for one? Why? <laughs> yeah! <laughs> you know, you're, <laughs> you're reversing it on me now? Yes. Get me on the camera, you're sucking the fucking horse. <laughs> <laughs> Is the horse in the back of the hand? Is the demonstration coming this way? Oh, he's been on a different event. Okay. Ooh. Okay. Thank you. He's not coming this way. We're going to it. Yeah, but how far are we going, mate? About 10 minutes, James said up here. Yeah, James is 10 minutes, so I'll keep on the air <laughs> Hotel. So have you ever been to Hyde Park, Darren? No, mate, it's my first time. What are you thinking? First time here. Well, it's not really a fucking park, is it? <laughs> <laughs> we're, not, we're on the outskirts of it. We're not in the mist. Oh, shouldn't, we, shouldn't we be in it? Or are we just walking into nowhere? Oh, my phone's ringing. Can you go yeah, there? you check the geo. James. Geo James's yeah. location. Okay. Are we on our way towards Buckingham Palace? Good all. Look, high park corner where we're meeting him. We're walking onto it. Minutes, Straight up this road. Is yeah, this way? Is, is this Paul's corner? Where we're going to now? This is where we're meeting the protest. We're, we're meeting the protest. Then we could ask about going to um, Parliament Square. How far? So see that screen? Is that screen getting me now as well? Yeah, yeah. Big screen? Is it wide? Yeah. I'm not bothered yeah, if it's not. I just want to know if it's like. It's getting all old enough there. What's it getting? It's getting you and all the background. Is it? Obviously, traffic's no, we're, The we're problem with London is, Darren, everything's very yeah. far apart. Uh, so it's like getting around takes time. Uh, we're going to further, like, here. But it's just, it's just up here now. Look, yeah. we're getting to see the more people. Is it? Yeah. Getting busier. Getting busier. You feel the energy changing as we get closer to the process. It looks better up that side. It looks like it's better up that side of the park. Yeah. All the lights and that, all little things to go and look at. We should be going in there. Yeah, we will. Come right past them. We will. It looks like there's something going on up there on the corner. What's up here then? the buildings are. The buildings are way old school, aren't they? Steak horns everywhere, isn't there? Yeah. You know, like, like structures of acorns? What is the importance of acorns? And old symbols. Alright, call me back. No protest up here, me mate. There's a big See stage ya. up there. See we'll do the protest and do the, the amusement right. thing we over are. here if you want. So we're coming along here. That's the 
that says, and that's where James is, so I'm following him. And is he with the protester? Yeah, we're stalking James. <laughs> 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 Big old seagull. Not scared of anything. Why? Well, they try and block it, don't they? Some independent media outlets. Up of the oh, is it? Yeah. Independent media outlets report, don't they? But all the big stations, they block it, don't they? Probably just put a little bit up. Yeah, so we can't get, so we can't cause fear, and that. Can't make any changes or anything. You see it on TikTok all the protests in London, but you don't see them on the news. Like, yeah. Well, there's a ban on them, isn't there? Because it's classed as propaganda, isn't it? Yeah. And you're not allowed to spread propaganda, and that's why they're entitled to not televise it, just for that reason, because it's classed as propaganda. You don't want a revolution? I think there's already a revolution in process, isn't it? It's just that we're not the revolutionists, someone else's. It's happening online now, isn't it? Because the information spreads, they can't stop it. So, is it meant to be a. Oh yeah, you can see it over there, look. It's quite, it's quite, quite a lot of people here, isn't there? <laughs> Christmas shoppers. Well, this is the beginning. This is the beginning of a little journey around London. I'm hoping to see some quite important places that you'd only see on stamps. <laughs> <laughs> There's a lot of activity over there, you, flags waving and, and, and stuff. That's the, knees, that's That'll get us around, wouldn't it? That's the you get on the <laughs> Darren getting his leaflets out on the bikes. <laughs> Yeah, it is. Yeah, yeah, it. Get into the mix, I think. Right. Close to the protest now. The noise. Energy picking up. We don't know what we're going to encounter here, do we? And it's freezing. Dangerous, couldn't it? I think they're mostly activists, aren't they? I've just become an activist for half an hour. <laughs> oh, we've got the whistles blowing, people. We've got the whistles blowing. Is it this gate here? There's, there's some gates here as well. Yeah. Well, this is probably the first protest I've ever been to. Me too. <laughs> I've never been to a protest. Should we start doing our own, But it's not looking like much of a protest at all. Scattered. It's not, it's not wholesome. They're not in battle formation. Yeah. So James is supposed to be around here somewhere, watch out. <laughs>
I should be doing, shouldn't I? <laughs> yeah, it goes for it. You got a fellow with a pig. Oh, this is a little pig. <laughs> so here we are, people. We're getting into the middle of it. <laughs> We've got all sorts of characters here. Look at the colours here. <laughs> Somewhere. We're going with the flow of the protesters. We've got all sorts of protests here. Doesn't matter what they look like, they're here. All having a shout. All with real concerns for the children. All with real concerns for the future. What's he going? Where are they going? What the hell? someone go and get that please right we need to get up and then get in yeah yeah so what we're doing people we're just missing all the shit getting to the middle of it getting in deep in the thick it's like the, um, 
Yeah. I'm not saying at all shit, I'm just saying, saying you know what I mean. Have you ever been in a mosh pit? <laughs> no. Like in the, no, what the rock music, but they're all like. Oh, I was, I was, I was a, I was a raver, Jen, not a mosher. Oh man, you're you were, mo were you were moshing to rock music. I'm into everything. <laughs> like, ACDC, come on. ACDC. Yeah. Don't we sit on the ACDC bench recently? Yeah, we're down fighting what on was my it head. ACDC? Well, no, it was. Um, oh, who was it? Uh, Ozzy Osbourne. Ozzy Osbourne. Mm. Birmingham. Yeah, where he fighted on my head. Yes. Yeah, I remember Where's that. James, the mysterious he's cameraman? Coming, he's catching up with us. He's Back behind us wood. now. We ditched him. <laughs> oh, oh. Right, where should we get back in? Um, I think there's more mist of it up there. Yes. Well, this is all right. And as soon as we get into Hyde Park, we've got a protest. And a big wheel. Where's the big wheel? Oh, in the background. <laughs> and I've just found this. It's so unfortunate. Oh, he's got, he's got a weapon and we've got a big wheel. I've got a legit weapon. <laughs> <laughs> it's quite new, that. It's a fishing fucking umbrella, isn't it? <laughs> That's like a cane, a walking cane, isn't it? It's like what, That's what it is. Batman, what, what was it? The penguin? Yeah. The neon one then. <laughs> this is a decent thing. It's not food, this. <laughs> taking the piss, I just like that. Sign just says taking <laughs> the piss. <laughs> <laughs> I just walk, might walk around Guildford with that like, taking the Spider-Man. Oh. Spider-Man! <laughs> <laughs> as you can see in my background here, people. He's been to jail. He's got a woman dressed as an American prisoner. <laughs> Truth, rights, freedom, that's great, isn't it? He's got the shackles on the neck and the shackles around the wrist if you look closely. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> Is this a silent protest? My mate, because they're not silent. Well, they're not making much fucking noise, are they? <laughs> <laughs> you know what I mean? Yeah. It looks like I it needs someone they to they get on a stage and start you... riling them all up. I know, where's so the stage? So what they're going to do is they're going to do this walk up, you know, with their megaphones and oh, signs. Yeah. And when they get here... We are on a frame. Next year I'll fight and we'll win. Here we are. It's getting congestion now. I can hear a few vocals getting in touch. And he bounces down here with a fucking walk and stuff, people. Fantastic. <laughs> <laughs> right, we need to be in the protest now, don't we? Yes. Who's the leader of the protest, you know? I have no idea that this well, is going the front. on. We oh, need to be at the front. There should be a stage, shouldn't there? We're speaking We're, somewhere. We need to get at the front so we can get that banner out. Yes. You know what I mean? Yeah. And then we'll just melt into the protest. Darren's got a massive banner. I've got a banner that I want to... As well as his le new out, leaflets. Yeah. Do you reckon we just melt back in? Yeah. It'll be more interesting with, next to all the people. Just stick with me then, Sean. Make yeah. sure the camera's on me. Got it, got it. <laughs> Might as well have these all out here. It's half like a little festival, isn't it? <laughs> yeah, yeah. It's got the atmosphere. Yeah, you have a smiley face behind him and then just behind there. 
Baron's doing his leaflet thing. Leaflets. white structure. on this oh, it's enough for my brain it's enough for my brain at the moment <laughs> come to a bit of a bottleneck in the protest a lot of people taking filming at this point Marble Arch. Here he is. I didn't know where you were. It's there, but I can't. Sorry, thank you. 
Here we are, Marble Arch. Is that the main gaff there? That's Marble Arch. Part of the main gaff. Well, where's the speech? Isn't that going to be taking place? We're at Marble Over Arch Station. When everyone stops, so look, they're all going around there. So I reckon they're heading to. Where's yeah, so let's, we need to get. We need to keep get going. Keep them. going. Yeah. She was handing out your flyer, so a, a Roman gladiator who was dressed, he had a helmet and, a, and like furry, a furry uh, jacket on. Excuse me, mate. Yeah. Come to deal with the crowd if we get out of control. We've got the redhead, he's the man that's coordinated. This is the main one, the one with the red on him. Give it. How are you, mate? You good? Yeah, man. Me and Sean, are you in this protest? What you're seeing now, people, you're seeing splatter the wrong, you're coming across little bits of police officers standing off, identifying people. We are blocking Oxford Street. How'd you get the screen back on? It's still going. But I can't see it. Oh yeah, it's power saver. So can you get the screen back on? I think if you like tap it or something. Oh, press one of the things. I just can't see where the camera is, mate. Yeah, yeah, there you, there go. you go. You gotta know where the cat. We're getting in the middle of it, Sean. Are you ready? Yeah, yeah. Great music as well. Let's get by that Union Jack. Hey, it's bouncing here. You're not even dishing them flyers yeah. out. <laughs> not one to the bus driver then. Where's Jenny? Uh, I think they're ahead of us. Or... The little dog people joining the protest. What kind of dog statue, you reckon? Hey, what's my new brolly, lad? Oh my gosh, I'm going to the people on the bus must be devastated, mustn't he? Trying to get home, the buses, buses are just sat there. <laughs> well, I think we need a leaflet, Darren. <laughs> Darren. Yeah, I've seen it. Look at that. They're getting everywhere, these leaflets. Sorry, mate. Oh. The whole length of Oxford Street is backed up. Yeah, but we need to get at the front. 
Well, I'll get through there, Sean, through that, that gap. Let's get down to the front. This must be the naughty crew. Let's get over here, Sean, and have a look. What are you? get this camera on. Yes, yeah, still on. Why does it keep on going off like that? Don't tell me. Otherwise, the battery goes. Right. So obviously, these must be potential. What are these? What's this A? Oh, that's anarchy. That's an anarchy flag. And what does anarchy stand for? You're all right talking on this, mate. What, no, what, really. what does that represent? What, what, what? It, it represents to not be ruled by a government rule. Yeah. It, it needs to be all peaceful, equal, live, let, let live. Do you know what I mean? Yeah. We all argue, disagree, to, and all that. Do you know Less control. Mean? Yeah, exactly. I'm thinking I was down right. We'll give you yes, one more thank, yeah, nice thank you, mate. Thank you. Cheers. Is <laughs> it recognised then? Yeah, yeah. <laughs> nice one, mate. Yeah, thank you. Thank you. Thank you. There you go. There's the officers making sure everything's running smoothly here in London. Everything's fantastic. Them two kids that got on me. Two more officers. Keeping the peace. Oh yeah. Come Come on, you can't tell me I cannot stand here. There is no law against it. There is a mandate. Mandates are no law. It's going back and forth. Let's draw a dictionary. All these fires are unlawful. The judges have thrown every single one out. If people did natural research, it would leave. It's getting heavy now. I can feel the energy building. Yeah, I'm getting warm. Females. Right, so who were them kids that got on me, them, them um, London kids, came over and said they liked the video? No, it's from YouTube. But they, yeah, but they got on me, you know? Yeah. But it is what it is, we're in London, we're here doing our thing. Got Sean behind me trying to keep up with me. <laughs> he doesn't know what's coming next. <laughs> I haven't seen him dish any flyers out. Oh, at least 10 so far. I want to be at the front of this queue. <laughs> You don't want all this content, do you? Can't yeah, carry yeah, on getting this. Bad. I love it. You're getting my fucking weapon there. <laughs> We're at Selfridges. Here we are outside Selfridges. <laughs> Shit. Nice t shirts. Sure. Do you want to get back on the camera? Yeah, yeah. What are you, you going? Go. <laughs> well, it's fun. It's, it's a buzz, isn't it? The energy. Uh, off he goes. High speed, Darren. Charging up Oxford Street.
busy London for you. Even when there's not a protest, a lot of London is just like this congested anyway. It's really hard to get around. Even when there's not a protest, Oxford Street's like this anyway, except for oh, yeah. people not like on the road. Anyway. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So amongst this protest, you've just got normal shoppers, haven't you? Yeah, yeah, Christmas shoppers. <laughs> Who'd have thought I'd be on a protest on Oxford Road with Darren G. <laughs> totally unplanned. Here we are. Trying to hang these <laughs> to the life, not a knife messages out. To the masses. Let the energy flow. Right, I'm not into this. Let's move along, lad, to get through this rubble. All right. Gonna go around the outside so we can speed up. That's it, we can have a little be there from all yeah. that combustion charge. <laughs> <laughs> I'm surprised there's no scousers down here, I reckon. It should be, shouldn't it? You do see some scousers here and there, but there's just so many. I think there's over 10 million people in London in the daytime yeah. from all over the world, all the different boroughs of London. So, so what's the population of London, 7.7 .7 million, isn't it? Yeah, yeah, is that's it? Um, is it right? something like that. Yeah, that's like the population. But, but with all the commuters, it goes up to over 10 million in the daytime. Oh, everyone's getting booed because they got the mask on. Yeah, mate. Yeah, mate. Yeah. What's going on here? That's a free Palestine flag. <laughs> oh, yeah. Free Palestine flag. Through all the distractions <laughs> and all the stuff that's going on around the world, don't forget the children of Palestine. The BBC is the virus. The, B the BBC is the virus. Classic. <laughs> Yeah. Street station. They're so depressed. It's sort of dead now, isn't it? Where's the leader of the path? Really, all to end up in like a big square or a big field or something. Yeah, that's where we need to. We yeah. need like yeah, look at this. Come on, man. Every time I look, every time I look round, I keep thinking I've got the ball. Let's see what it says. We need to find uh, Steve. We are. <laughs> You've got to unite to win that fight, mate. Exactly, mate. There you go, people. Cheers. So we've got shoppers and then we've got protesters. 
And if the protest gets violent, what happens to the shops? Collateral damage. Hopefully it doesn't get violent. Hopefully it passes off nicely. Joker there on his one wheel. Oh, yeah, 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 yeah. That's cool, isn't it? He's got his little wheelie unicycle. Is that protesting there? Give them the boots. Effectively blind the motor out of the fucking road, so people can pick them up, you know what I mean? <laughs> <laughs> we need to pay somewhere. Yeah, we're getting into the... Um, you can just see the change. Yeah. You know, when people... You're getting into like... The energy's infectious. So if you don't wear a mask, you're a slave now, so be careful. <laughs> <laughs> you have know, got people over there saying, get your mask off, you slave. <laughs> that bus just looks bored. Life, not a knife. L5 alive. Gonna bother you, sir. Thank you. Thank you very much. Have a nice night. Mm. Mm. That was fun. <laughs> Quite simply, but what? <laughs> Hello, beautiful people of London. I'm just standing somebody to tell, try and put a smile on your lovely faces. Thank you. <laughs> yeah, I'm driving. There's one for you, bro. We need vaccine passports, I've got mine. <laughs> what are you saying, buddy? I said I've got my vaccine passport, they're necessary. Good for you, lad. Keep it up. He was blind there. Oh. Oh, what we got here? What the hell? Oh, we got here, Dad. How are you, fella? You well fed in that? Are you alright? No, yeah, he's got all soft going for him. Other than he's on the streets, he's got everything else. Yeah. And some people like that like that better than most. Right, we're seeing a large police presence up there on the left. Oh, yeah. All the vans, all the vans. It's, James, end, it's, it's, Jenny. it's endless. Endless. Oh, there's thousands. Like Liverpool's just like yeah, up, you go up and down. London just never ends. Someone's stuck up. Thousands from Liverpool down there. Yeah. Oh! Feeling it now. Well, I don't even know what's happened, and I'm excited. <laughs> woo, 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 woo. Looks like it's getting a bit. Energy's ramping up. Oh. 
So although it's good, and although there's a lot of activity, there's no leadership. Do you understand what I mean? They're just like packed in and not being led. Look at this gang of cops here. Look oh, at we've this. got we've got soldiers screaming at the cops. Let's get in here. Oh, they're on the right. They're on the move. Police are starting to respond. The police are starting to respond in an aggressive manner. This is what's going on now. But it is the Cajun people in. You fucking took your sides, you cunt. Fucking deserve what you get. Can you see how they're working? So this is where it all is. If we're going to get violence, this is the place. If we're going to have a protest going off, this is the place. Sorry. That was getting interesting now. Well, Sean's gone on the missing list. He's probably looking for me, but concerned. I got recognised quite a bit up there then. Quite a few people were recognising me. So it's not, it's not going to be long before something wild goes on. Giving Sean a chance to meet me. If he doesn't come, I'm going missing right into the middle of that protest. There he is. So we found him. Yeah, I just found him there. Yeah, yeah, get a picture. Yeah, what's happening? Are you yeah. good? Yeah, alright, mate. Perfect. Good to meet you all. Oh yeah, you too. Thank you. Thank you. Got moody, got moody back there, didn't it? I got recognised. Did you? Bit, didn't you hear them all? Fucking hell. Oh, I know about you. I'm thinking, oh, do you, mate? Yeah? <laughs> but as I was saying on the camera when you went missing then, yeah. if anything's going to go, yeah. it's going to go this half of the parade. Yeah, yeah. It's, it's not going to go off. Of I think it's going to go off right if there. If it's going to go off, it's going to go off this half of the parade. I think it's going to go off right there. That, that was Where we was, they were getting in the policemen's faces and that. Yeah, totally. Do you want to get back in there, do you? It was good uh, oh, viewing. Definitely just wait because they all are now. It was good viewing. So what they're doing, they're starting to contain. So if you watch, if you keep on me, don't be panicking because the police are coming. <laughs> but as you can see, they're in a rush. Get in front of me, Sean. Yeah. As you can see, we've got the police on a mission. We've got half a dozen, a dozen police officers going down to take the next stage of kettling. What's kettling? <laughs> Keeping everyone in a position so they can't become unlawful, so they can't become volatile. 
This is getting deep down this end. It's getting, it's getting proper. You can feel the tension in the energy. People are becoming more vocal. You know, there's a lot more angry people. But what the problem is, the problem you've got is this. You've got normal day-to-day -day shoppers mixed in with the protesters and it's not working out. Now, as you can see, we're going to tag along the policemen. the authorities have picked up pace they're feeling more aggressive they're feeling like the motivation's there to cause trouble with the public as you can see they're all shapes and sizes some are fit and healthy some aren't some are overweight but they all do the same job they all do the same thing protect the public I don't know where these are going, but they're going somewhere. He's harassing them. Is he? Is he? In his face like that, boy. Yes, boy, take one of them, please. Nice one, lad. Got to appreciate what they're doing, haven't you? You've got to have like half a what they're doing. Is it wrong? Is it right? Are they just doing the job? Or are they all? <laughs> 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 Come on, let's get a move on. Where's Jenny in that? Oh man, we've lost them. We've got where the action is though. We need some excitement, don't we? Yeah, I think we're gonna about to find it. Do you reckon that's where all these are going, rushing to an incident? Yeah, something's up, isn't it? There's a load of them here, look. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Wow. Wave this now and start going through the gaffs. Do you reckon? Or do you want to just walk them around in circles. Where do you want to go? Where's going to end with the final shout? Should we ask some of the protesters where this is going? 
Yeah, well, that's get someone now. We need to get him through the goal. Should we go on the inside of the road? I think he's going to Piccadilly Circus. Oh, is it? It's going to come on to us. Let's get in it. Now nah, we need to be up there. Oh, they're learning, look, look, battle formation. They're doing battle formation now, look. These two are leading. So let's get by them, because when they stop, that's when everyone's going to squatter. I see. They're the senior officers. Yeah, you see the red on the hat? Yeah. They're the one that give the orders. Okay. I think we're at Piccadilly Circus here. Have you ever been there before? It's a big landmark. I've never been to none of these gaffs. Yeah. A lot of people gather here, so they might stop here. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah, how's it going? How's it going? Yeah, yeah, cheers. Yeah, okay. Darren G with Take me as well. Trip. See what you've got everywhere, the spotters. Spotters? Yeah, see the ones in the red hats. Ah. Spotting all over the gas. Yeah, yeah. Oxford Circus. Oxford Circus. Are they? Yeah, yeah. Everyone's filming it. It's crazy, isn't it? But we're on half of the fucking film. <laughs> the best bits. Well, when I was going through before, we did someone's film I'm going, Oh, I'm alive, no way! We, right, did get, we got to the front of it, didn't we? This is the front. <laughs> Talking to them. To be honest with you, that microphone's need needs be, to be used for something a bit more powerful than singing. Oh, you're right, look, they are, they're encircling it. So this is going to be the, the end point. Oh no, they just told them to go down here. Someone needs to take a stand then and start giving some sort of speech, don't they? Rile everyone up. I reckon they're all going to start chanting and stuff. You're not allowed to get on these or something? Yeah, you're on a day like today. <laughs>
say she died or someone killed him, I don't know. It might be a good place for him to catch up with us here because everyone knows where it is. Let me call him. Alright, well let's get out the way. We got over here somewhere. Hello? You know what though? I reckon we just carry on going. Because we're gonna get caught in all that bullshit okay. again. Come on. Let's get on with it. Okay. Don't be worried, lah. We're fine. No, it's great. This is a uh, really good. London action viewing energy up crowds riled up Yeah. So what's the shout they use? Don't know, I've never been on one of these. Hey Cap. <laughs> I remember the miners one. I'd rather be a miner than a scab. <laughs> Where are they getting us to here? Yeah. Where's the final destination, do you know? No. I thought that was gonna be it, but they started moving again. So Sean, this is shit content. No, it's not, it's good. It's crazy town. It's like a police state. Do you know where the whole thing's going? I think they're gonna, we're gonna end up in uh, Hyde Park. Hyde Park? I think so, yeah. It's going back to Hyde Park, Darren. He said it's going back to Hyde Park. Yeah, from the previous protests, you know. Okay. Yeah, yeah, how you doing? How you doing, mate? Yeah, yeah, yeah good to meet you. Yeah. Oh, that. thank you. Can I get a selfie with you? So yeah, I'm totally. Yeah. With Darren G over here as well. Oh, is he? Yeah, 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 yeah. <laughs> Nice yeah, yeah, she is. What are you here for? Just start covering it all? Like, yeah, you know, with Darren. He's only been to uh, London three times. And um, yeah. James, my camera guy, he was filming this earlier, so we, we just yeah. jumped, on, jumped onto it. Do you know where it's going to end up? No, no idea, mate. I'd okay. come up here to do a bit of shopping in London. Oh, did it? So, did you? Yeah. <laughs> so, we're going to disband in here, aren't we? Let's cut off to the side then, Sean. Catch up to this at the park, aren't we? We'll have to walk there, we, for the park. So, I have no clue where we are, Darren. If we just walk off down here, we I could end up... I reckon they're going to go down there and do a right. I we could end up anywhere. You want to go down there and do a left? Yeah. Okay. They're all not in line. They're all... look tired. We've been marching for a long time, we've got a lot of equipment in, we've all got masks on. We've got the public engaging, giving them loads as always. They turned round, so they're going again.
I've never like been on a modern protest where everyone just films it, everyone's just got the camera out. I've never seen that before. This is the first protest I've been to. Is it? Yeah. We are recording again. Just waiting for Jen to catch up. For that advent, not adverse. Yes, bro, you good? Good, man. How are you doing? Did you get a picture with you? Yeah, do you have a flyer? Yeah, man. What's in? What's in? You're all part of this protest, or are you shopping? Yeah, mate. Part of the protest, mate. Yeah. It's Jen. It's Jen. How are you doing? Oh, yeah. Oh, hi. Hey. How have you been? Fucking hell, how have you been? I'm loving it. Oh, we got right in where it was going to kick off. Where it was like, they were like, like that. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You've been handing out your flyers left, right, and center. Yeah. Just jumping on buses and doing it and everything. Is he? Flying. Oh, fucking got banana. Want some? Want some of your Don't. Flying whole buses. Yeah, as you can see, they're off. The James never find. I got on a megaphone, he's going, choose a light! Was ya? Was ya? Well done. I filmed it, Ooh. so you can see it. Yeah, Sean. Freedom! Jesus, that's set you free, the Bible says. Freedom! Set you free! Hallelujah! Hallelujah! <laughs> <laughs> I'll take one each, yeah? Yeah, to be truly free, oh, you know, nice I know Jesus, haven't you? Yes, and you've got you. Cheers. 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 How have you enjoyed the march so far, Jen? I'm having a whirl of time. Honestly, it's a natural high. <laughs> it is, it's, it's contagious, isn't it? When yeah. it, it's like, at different levels of it, I've the energy the went... I've jumped up on the side. <laughs> I um, was filming them saying, F the police, which was quite amusing. <laughs> um, yeah, it's exciting. Now Darren's having a chat with a copper. What's that always saying? <laughs> uh, there's no violence in today, then, is there? Has it okay. been peace and, peace and calm for all? Have you had a few? I've already, I've already been in one school place. Have you been, been situated in a certain designated area? Just to make sure everyone's safe, facilitate everyone here. Well, if you look at the troops, they all look dishevelled. It looks like they need some vitamin C, look. <laughs> I'm tired, but you know what? Doing, doing a sterling job, you've got to say it. Look how look how orderly the crowd is, and that's what their job is today: keeping the crowd orderly. Right. So yeah, I sent James the location. So fingers crossed. Who's James? He's doing a live. He can follow me for an hour, basically. Is he, is he filming it as well? Where he is? I guess so. With his big satellite. <laughs> <laughs> that is going to be a running fucking joke about James. The satellite. The satellite. <laughs> Sky. <laughs> yeah. Did you have fun, Sean? Oh, we went to this one part where it was just thick with people, mm. and all these big men were just yelling in the faces of the cops. Yeah, Did you go through that one? It's quite amusing. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Did you start yelling? I, I thought it was going to just kick off at that, mo at that moment. Did you yell? I've been yelling the whole time, yeah. <laughs> Chanting and yelling, and uh, yeah, yeah. the Christmas shoppers here today. <laughs> I said to, um, uh, to Darren that I should do my Christmas shopping while walking. <laughs> I've been so much fun, they kept locking all the shops up. <laughs> Pity no windows went through, could have just helped yourself. <laughs> no. Like the uh, LA riots. <laughs> what were the LA riots? Over Rodney King. Oh, okay. Yeah. Look at this divine Christmas tree. Isn't it beautiful? Beautiful. Have you got a trip, Sean? <laughs> got. <laughs> St. James's. Far more civilised part of London then. He's following us. Yeah. So you can follow exactly where we are. That's cool, isn't it? You're on it, aren't you?
Jen's geo tracking, James. Technology today, isn't it? Where's Darren? Got a lot of historical buildings. Are they important anymore? I'm not too sure if they are. <laughs> I, feel, I feel like that park is where the protest is going to end. Oh, yeah. that's not, is that took so us back to the park? No, it's not Hyde Park. Oh, shit. What park that? Hyde Park? No, Hyde Park's back up there, isn't it? Well, I've heard that protest. Have we not looped round, though? No. We have been walking like that, haven't we? Straight, I don't know. Well, we've been swerving to the right. So, Sean and Jenny's reappeared. They have just got some powerful content there. Right, so, St. Paul's Cathedral is over there, that building. See on, um, yeah, and is that yeah. where it's ending up? I don't know, but they're going to like the old Bailey. The protest there continuing. Yeah, it should be drawing. Look at Goldilocks up there. Wow, that's just fast, isn't it? Is that there, see it? Yeah, so. yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah, of course. <laughs> like, look at the Roman kings, like the figurines at the top. What you used to see on, on, on that pottery. What's that pottery called? Oh, I can't remember the name. I know what you mean, though. Oh, uh, China. She... No, I look up there. Oh, it's called. Um... Oh, shit. Reese. But, uh, nah, it's a certain pottery with that design. What is that building? I remember it now. I'm going under. Going in. Oh, isn't it gorgeous in here? Oh, Absolutely place. beautiful. What is this, what is this place? <laughs> oh, sorry, it's a private. <laughs> What's it called? Oh yeah, it's famous. What's it called? It's like celebs and politicians and everything well, come I've here. Just, well, I've just Athenum. After them, and yeah. I'm just being in there with me with me smudge. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, big time that place. See them running off? Who the hell? <laughs> I thought he had his fucking Willy in his hand there. Look. Oh, I did as well. Look at that. Dirty mind. Uh, Defender of London. Air Chief Marshal Sir Keith Park. Air Chief Marshal Sir Keith Park, Commander Number Two Group Fighter Command, which defended London Town. London For our Town. freedoms. Take a look at You liking it? <laughs> Ups and now. It looks boss. Smells boss. It's absolutely boss, isn't it? Yeah. It's better than being in fucking Birmingham at the moment. <laughs> Birmingham's boss, but I'm just there too much here on it. So it's nice to it's nice to get out of the way. And Uzi, John Fox Bergoin. John Fox Bergoin died 1871 for us. Who was he fighting? Napoleon? He's in the war or something, really. <laughs> it was against the French back then. Right, so I reckon the protest is going to take the detour around the block and end up back here. You reckon? This is where we was, isn't it, before? High Park. I think it's a different park, Darren. Yeah, I think it is. Are you sure? Yes. Yeah. yeah. Like this, la. Saying that, that was on our left when we York. Frederick, Duke of York. Frederick. That looks like we're, like, like a fucking... What are they called? Where they used to detain people years ago. Gulags. Not a jail. What do you say, Kulov? Cool Gu gulag. Gulag. That's what the Russian ones were called. Wow. Them Russian ones are next level, aren't In they? In Siberia. Ivan Donosovic. Yeah, they're next level, them are. I feel like I could do Rocky. <laughs> <laughs> What's this? Oh, so yeah. Here we go. Google. 
Here we go, here we go. So we're on it. Called it, called it. Woo, they're coming in. Coming in fast. Are they? Please man dance that. <laughs> That's the palace? Yeah, there's That's Buckingham Palace, palace Darren. Let's go. Let's go. Look, we've spent too much time on the protest. We've okay. been here for hours and all we've been focused on is some shit protest. There's not really any action going on. There's no commander, there's no colonel, there's no leader. Until then, it needs fucking off. Buckingham oh, Palace needs... People walking around with the incense sticks. Someone's not following them for the sun. <laughs> Buckingham <laughs> Palace needs a Kalnak leaflet delivered to it. I mean, you've, got to, you've, got, to, you've got to do things like that to get your voice heard, but it's heard and then forgotten very fast. Yeah. Unless you've got a leader who's commanding things and you can't just be vocal these days. We're past vocal. How long have you been vocal for? 10, 15 years? They give you permission to be vocal. So everyone's being vocal. It's all about action now. Use leaders out there. Use use different spirited men, warrior so spirited men. Get into it. Spread the message of Kalnak then. Uh -huh. How are you going to spread the message of Kalnak? What's your Well, you've just seen it there. As I'm, plan. as I'm yeah. walking through London, I've got people approaching me over the message. Yeah. So it's Sean went with me when the majority of it happened. Sean bailed. Where did he go, Sean? <laughs> he, he, went, lost him well, he went for like a <laughs> vegan lunch. We got noticed with Sean, he gets scared of the police. We got separated <laughs> a few yeah, times. Sean gets scared we of the police. Right in the midst, Sean yeah. gets scared of the police. <laughs> <laughs> Don't you, Sean? I think he spent enough time. You wouldn't even him. put the camera on them. I had to get your hand and go, look. <laughs> <laughs> Didn't I? Just then. <laughs> it is a weird situation being so close to the police, though. What do you mean you're so close to the police? It's a weird situation, oh, isn't it? Being, more coming. being in the vicinity of Yeah, them. yeah. Look at it all. Don't we want to be where they're going? Oh shit, there's another convoy. Yeah. Nah, they're all going, let them. Look, why do you want to be in the middle of it? I don't know. It gets like, addictive. Go to, like, it gets trouble. addictive. You're kind of like rooting for it to explode. Yeah. <laughs> right, get the camera on Sean. Whoa. Get the camera on Sean. On me. On me. <laughs> There's Mad, more, there's more. Madness. Oh my god. I'm gonna do the priest. Ambulances, oh, that's there's, not a good There's gonna be a war down there, Dad. Oh, no. We're gonna miss the We're gonna miss the war, I reckon. Oh. You wanna go and get messed up in that? No, I wanna yes. visit the Queen. Let's get down there, let's get on the gates of the palace. <laughs> Put me banner up. Mm. Have you got the banner then? Yeah, I've got a banner in the bag. Can cool. I? Bad. There's a lot of food. It's a great day for content. Yeah. <laughs> well, we picked a good day to come to London, Darren, really? didn't you? <laughs> Watch out, Darren. <laughs> oh, shit. <laughs> so, is this where Poets Corner is down here? No. No. We will go to Poets Corner. <laughs> you know what? I think it was a good decision leaving that behind. Yeah, At we want to bury the energy. We'd be well in custody. <laughs> we were in the thick of it for the majority of it. Yeah, we ended yeah. up at the front of it. Yeah. But these were in with us to get the banner. So you see where they put that banner up? See where they put that banner up, Sean, on the front of their thing? Yeah. We could have done that with my banner, couldn't we? Yeah, yeah, totally. What time is it? I can hear them now. Jen, let them get on with it. Come on, we've, had, we've, had, we've absorbed it. There's me like, I want to be in You just want to see the, the explosion, you don't you? The battle. The violence, yeah. isn't it? Not the violence, I just want to see how it's dealt with. I'll sit, stand back and watch. Police procedures? <laughs> You're interested yeah. in police procedures? Of course. <laughs> <laughs> We're on the Queen's map now. We're almost on the Queen's doorstep. This is the Queen's Park, isn't it? Yeah, what's it called? Um, Queen's Park? Shit, no, it's got a name. Um, What's that here with all the flags on? It's got all kinds of ducks and stuff. See that with all the flags of the countries? Yeah. What is it? Be What's behind it? Some kind of embassy Diplomatic. or something, is it? Anyway, I just want to get to Buckingham Palace. I've never been, you see. So... Security's going to be tight up here. I want to see one of them... I want to see a Darren Waterhouse in real life. Like, I want to see a Goldstream guard. 
a, a beef eater, you mean? No, you see a Goldstream guard. You know them that stand outside Buckingham Palace with the big fair hat on? Yeah. Beefeaters. Oh, are they beef eaters, are you going to pull faces at them? If I can. <laughs> yeah, but they'll shout at you. They do it at uh, Tower of London and shout at you. Well, that'll be good viewing. <laughs> it's, bad. it's about the experience, not the viewing. Look at the gates on that, la. Switch it round, Sean. Show them the gates. What park is that? St. James. St. James Park. It's another, another convoy coming through. Right, for some reason. Every single van has been coming from that street. Yeah. Every single call out speaks. Should we go down the street and see what's there? That's the headquarters, the isn't it? Right, please. You must have right a by the palace to keep Queen safe. Yeah, we'll turn that off for a bit, Sean. Yeah. If it, if it I feel under constant fucking pressure. Got it. <laughs> if... So Dara now wants to talk to the Queen's guards. Here we are. Buckingham Palace. Are the red ones then? So what are these? Uh, Buckingham Palace. Oh, there he is, he's doing his march. Can you see him? Yes. So they're the iconic soldiers. Yes. So basically, Darren Waterhouse, the one that killed little Craig, was one of them. Oh, was he? Yeah. Yeah. Look at them there on the step. Oh, yeah, they've got like guns. <laughs> <laughs> like fully automatic. So really weapons. people outside Buckingham Palace feeling absolutely fantastic. I don't know why. But I'm just feeling fantastic. Oh, pretty little up here. Yeah. In a bit of distance, aren't they? Do you want to go? What is it? Buckingham Palace officially just got leafleted. Calder. This is Buckingham Palace. Ignore Jenny, she's gonna smile. <laughs> Uh. Obviously, what are you she doing? Mm. What are we always doing? What getting, we always getting, do? a, getting a hand cramp, an arm cramp. Do you want me to hold it for a while? You can I'm try right. holding this I it. suitcase. I got it. <laughs> do you feel at home, Darren? Yeah. <laughs> Your new home. Do you remember that nutter who climbed the gates? And went in? Yeah. Did you watch it on the crown? Yes. Yeah, yeah. Oh man. And he like, like he talked to her, didn't he, and everything? <laughs> yeah, talked to the Queen. That, that man who broke in. He broke in, he got over the Into the Queen's bedroom. 
Well, what happens if you climb on that fence now? You, you get shot by those men in the, over there. Yeah. yeah. Probably take you down first and give you a warning, but. Doubt it. <laughs> not, the, not in this day and age. So if I climb on that now, they'll shoot me. Do mm. not see that you're there. <laughs> <laughs> I don't think so. Mm. Right, get the content. If you try and get in the building, I think they shoot you. If you just get over that fence, they might give you a warning. Because he went to prison, didn't he? <laughs> yeah, he was he determined he was mentally ill. He was unemployed and everything. He was complaining about social inequality to the queen in a, in a bedroom yeah it was well the fact the, that he got in was like a, a huge security lapse do the thatcher um yeah Mag Morris. maggie thatcher yeah the milk snatcher that's that funny maggie thatcher the milk that's what they call it because she stopped the, the milk in the schools let me hold that for a while camera can see you make sure you camera shy yeah. Sure yeah, I'm now I've lost the stone. Don't be spiteful. Yeah. yeah, so we got Skinny Sean. <laughs> Skinny Sean has spent his weekend dealing with YouTube after getting hacked by Russian Bitcoin cyber criminals. So what I'm gonna do is just gonna put this up on there for a bit and then leave it there for another 10 minutes. Should we stand by you? No, you stand here and watch it. Could we hold the other end? Baron G is officially putting a banner the life on tonight. the Buckingham Palace fence. <laughs> the Royal Highness is now peeping out of the window. Do you want to get a photo of us next to it? Photo with me standing there. Yeah, yeah. Got it? Yes, that on, lads. Like Sam, are you good? Yeah, I'm Spouse is there. You ever get one of us three? What are you buzzing for? What are you posing for? <laughs> Jen's here as well. <laughs> Gotta get in on the action. Oh, shit. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you, lad. So, do you think this will get the message across to the Queen? I think the Queen is going to be peeping out of her bedroom window in a minute. <laughs> chucking, chucking her. Uh, she's going to be on this, like, tight and strong. She's going to be doing this out the window. L5 <laughs> alive. <laughs> oh, shit. Yeah. Hold it then, Sean. Come on, Sean. Jenny, Jenny. Yeah, Sean, come on, hold it here, lad. Really tight. I'll get a photo of you, Johnny. Okay. <laughs> 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 oh, la. <sighs> We're getting a bit of an audience here, so we need to be sightseeing that. Went to that window on the land as well. Is it, was it any good up there? Protest. Protest in the middle of town. <laughs> no, it was chaos. I've never seen it. We were right in the middle. That's what it was. Yeah. <laughs> what was that for? Quite intense. For? That anti vaccine thing. Oh, was yeah. it? Yeah. What were you down here for? No, we just come down to deliver this message, mate. Yeah. Yeah. Keep it flowing. Do you want some leaflets? Yeah, go on. We'll take go on. Some. Which way is the Winter Wonderland? Yeah, Hyde Park. Oh, it's back Thank at Hyde Park. That's what we passed. Yeah, yeah. There, yeah. yeah. Nice speaking to you, bro. Oh, oh, yeah, yeah. Take James care. Cheers. You. See you later. We've got to wait for James. Yeah, he's going to be here in a minute. We're just James should be here any minute. Darren, he's going to be here any minute, James. Well, let's go over here and look at the place. Then we can make the way back. Yeah, yeah, back. Turn, turn it off. off. Yeah, I'll turn it off. We're at Speaker's Corner as well. Where is it? Yeah, so we have to sign up here. Is it not active now? No, I've been dying to get down here. No, to this speaker's corner. Yeah, one sec, one sec, let me finish. So the minute I tell them it's not to do with the vaccination, they take one off. That's what's happening. Sorry, love. Yeah. Hey, it's good for the wind. It's a good Sunday, sorry, mate. The Latin episode in itself. Darren G at Poets Corner. Well, this is a place, oh, this area here, the speaker's corner. Are I you getting us on that camera? You should do, yeah, it's, it's recording. Twice, so. It's recording, you see at the front, you've got the red light going, so you're recording. It's just 
Some people end up not not participating in that sort of thing. Whether you sat at the computer all day like this. What what I haven't liked is Jenny farting all day. <laughs> she farts at mad times. Oh my god, that was like a ripper. I'm dealing with a man child. A man child. <laughs> oh my god. Pure pear, pure turtle's neck. <laughs> One of them sucking it in and out. You know what I mean by a turtle's neck, don't you, Jen? Um, no, sorry. <laughs> well, cos you're from London, you just called Women it a man's toe. Women don't poo. You don't poo? Women don't poo. You're lying. Mm -hmm. I've seen birds shit their pants in them. <laughs> <laughs> I've seen birds follow through in that. Oh, after a fart. Yeah, it's called a shark. Have you ever done it? What's no. it called? A shark. One of my Shart. friends had, she did it in a caravan last year, by accident. So Jennifer's mate farted and shit. No, I'm not pants. naming her name, poor girl. Yes. <laughs> so we were here before. There's that thing. We was out of here before. We was at there before. differences back then. It is what it is. It's putting the work in when you can barely walk. Now amongst amongst all this hustle and bustle, amongst all these Christmas festivities, amongst everyone getting drunk, amongst everyone having fun, you've always got homeless people in need of any help you can give them. It doesn't matter whether they've got addictions. It doesn't matter if you think that the money that's going to them. That addiction, when they can't manage it first thing in the morning, is like getting burnt by hot rocks continuously. They need to get that first hit in the morning to make them feel right for the day. So don't think you're doing wrong by giving them a couple of pounds, because if it sorts that first thing out in the morning, yeah, you're buying the drugs for them, but you're dealing with a lot of suffering that they're gonna go through till they get that first hit. Anyway, let's have a little look around. This is where they did the public hangings. This is where they do public hangings and that's why Sean's here.
to get in one of them. We're currently looking for some food. So we're looking for food. Don't know what type of food it's going to be. But we're looking for it. Hopefully everything will fall into place. It's not like a little smoker's corner, so it's bound to be. Taking his lads. Well, this is their way right, so there's loads of restaurants. Yeah. I think we bought loads of things. It looks fucking dead. Are you sure? Yeah, it's a problem. Just check your phone, James. We've got to do it left. What? Yeah. James doesn't know where he's going. James, stop acting like you're a map lad. What's this road? Just the area, like the affluence around in London is different, isn't it? You don't see this sort of infrastructure and that up north. You see similar, but not. That's been here for a bit, that's got two tickets on it. Get on me. City of London, you've got an attempted robbery. Let's go. <laughs> On me, how do I feel? This is the best going once again. Should we wait or should we not? Oh, 
Okay then, where are we eating? Al Balad. Going to Al Balad. You sit outside then. You look like a bike machine. <laughs> What's that? Yeah, what about that? Do you need a mountain? Yeah. Do you need a mountain over here? It's off the corner, it's a little bit over there. It's sweet there, won't it? Oh shit. Where did you say Darren's on here? Wow. Yeah, with the white seats yeah. on. And the heat lamps outside. It's not right. It's so unusual. Mm -hmm. So here we go people, don't know where I am, just floating down London, yes mate. It's power saving mode. So I can sit down off the box. Wow. And now, Are you how gonna quick do, do that? 48 hours. Shit. We haven't been to Liverpool yet, but we haven't been. Let's go. Let's go. I think that's the end one. Newcastle leads Manchester. Go so to you're Manchester. Do, when are you going to do, be doing these before Christmas? That's my plan. That's why there's all... That's oh. what, what's Guess this one? Falafel. Falafel. Oh yeah. That's why them flyers have got Christmas stuff on, see? I get you. Oh you yeah. Out? So hungry. It's a Christmas message, isn't it? Cauliflower looks great. No, I struggled to find Hang on a minute. Out. How come you you're eating and no one else's? It's because they prioritise me. That's what I'm saying. <laughs> yes, mate. Oh. Hello. Thanks. Mm. Cheers, mate. Mm. Hello, James. Oh, you you sitting on the table, do you? Huh? You don't want you sitting on the table, do you? Yeah. Have you given us all these as fuck? Hey, how did you see the James? Yeah. Oh, don't be so, you. These ones. That's a bit of a wiener. Wiener! <laughs> Wiener! <laughs> it sounds like a name of a girl, doesn't it? Wiener! Rowena! <laughs> Ro oh, that's me! You're not Wiener! I was going to say, you can't be calling a child Wiener! Rowena! <laughs> well, nobody will know. Oh, is that what you was on about? Wow, well, that's a shower Wiener! My many drinks. Mmm! Are you not cold eh? In the beer. You're all right. I open the mouth. Yes. Thank you. And the milk. Yes. 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 What's your drink lemon? Thanks a lot mate. Huh? Yes. Nice one. Yeah. Look at that. On my tea. <laughs> oh, oh that's not. Hot milk. Do you drink that? Oh, like with every meal? Oh, that's true. Yeah. Yeah. I would drink milk more than water. water. I'm not hot like that, so I'll be. Spare glass, sir. Thank you. What are you drinking, alcohol? I'm having a beer, a green tea, and a... Can I get some sparkling water as well, please? Sparkling water as well. Sparkling water. And some sparkling water. Who wants to? Uh, I guess might a bit. Oh, sorry, I'm sorry, I'm Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. James, you blocked Darren. Sorry? You blocked. You blocked. He done it on purpose. What you thought meant on Instagram? Provoking yeah. a reaction. <laughs> James wants a reaction. Cheers. He said we need to get James's opinion in more videos because I love it. Say nothing. That way aimed at you. Yeah. I didn't. I didn't like give you a headshot. It just came out. <laughs> No, 
I've got to film myself doing an advert soon. Doing what? An advert. What is it? What advert? For a workshop. So I've got to sell myself and try and come across as really I mean, it's all going to Yeah, I'm going to need some direction, so I've yeah, got to be a bit more... Get it off him. <laughs> more than two. I've got to be really lively and just, like, try and sell it, yeah, which is difficult, so I'm going to need to coach myself to do it. Oh, my God. Where's Camden from here? Oh, it's quite distant. It's north. I'll have to come back again. That's what I mean. They're all episodes that can be like considered. Darren and Camden Market. You'd like you, it there. Camden Market. Episodes that nice. one. They're easy. Got the food. It's got a train station as well, haven't it? Like an historical train station. Yeah. Is it proper old or is it like a new one? Oh, you're perfect. Thank you. Do you want the history lesson? Sparkle water. So it costs you about five. Couple of streets down. Oh, sorry, what was that? Two hundred. 201 oh, yes, years ago. Mmm, Schumacher. Would you like that? It's all about the chips, isn't it? One down here. I'll share that one with you then. So, 201 years ago, a couple of streets from here, there was a conspiracy to overthrow the government. Yeah. They reckon they were set up by an agent provocateur. Right. So, there's a group of men that met up, yeah. probably about 15 of them. They met in the stables, probably five minute walk from here further down there. Yeah. They caught them and they tried them and they were sentenced to be hung, drawn and quartered. And they were they were hung and beheaded in front of a crowd of a hundred thousand people down in the near St Paul's. They were meant to be quartered, but the people that cut their heads off said no quartering them's too barbaric. So they just cut their heads off and held their heads to the crowd and said these are the heads of traitors. Oh, yeah. It was like 1820. Wow. So it's called the Cato Street Conspiracy. You're very knowledgeable, aren't you, James? Well, I studied history. So that and my dissertation was about crime in the 19th century. And as I was studying for the year, yeah. I found out during the Second World War, all the records for crime, police crime in the 19th century were lost. Mm. So we don't know much about Excuse what me. happened. Do you have any fetishes? From 1820 <laughs> to about 1880. <laughs> yeah, because oh, the, the, all the records were lost during the Second World War. Yeah, thanks. They got bombed and destroyed. Funny that. So there could have been like, other crimes that, right happened John, that would have been so. like really notorious crimes, but they've been lost. Wow. Is that for everyone? No. Sean, for you in there. Oh. Everyone's had a little spoon of a scrap pie. I thought you started, Darren. Ming, 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 ming. Yeah, it's half time. Sorry. Uh, <laughs> Look, right. at, look at Sean just wrecking the rice so no one else will have any help. on it. <laughs> Pours all that crap over it. You know the guy who um, was um, in Jaws, the one, that the one who got eaten by the shark? Yeah. Who played the mad guy? He wrote a play about the Cato Street conspiracy. Really? Yeah. Robert Shaw. Oh, yeah. I think it would make a great film. Have you yeah. seen the uh, Peter Lou film that's no. done recently? Mike Lee, it's about the Peter Lou massacre, no. where they sent soldiers into a, a protest in Manchester in 1819. Yeah. And the soldiers killed about 20 protesters with swords that cavalry went in and they were just cutting people down. Did that happen today? <laughs> yeah. <it could laughs> do. You they know. just beat them up badly now, don't they? I'll tell you what I watched, la not last night, not before, sorry, it was the Salisbury. Um, Poisoning. Poisoning. Have yeah. you seen that series? It's on Netflix now. Right. That's really good. good. KGB stuff, wasn't it? Thank you. Thank you. It's really interesting. Thanks. Have you brought everything out yet? Have they? Got it. So I ordered them. I ordered them. This is just the shittest thing. Oh, what? It's amazing, it's Rabbit. It's like you made an effort, but you didn't. No, I thought we were going to get it first. Yeah. You beat me to it. You lowered your arms if you like. Well, at least he's tried. You two trying to hold hands? <laughs> I've started feeling guilt. What's wrong, lad? I'm, I'm missing something. <laughs> he, can't, he can't not have his hummus. Hello, what's wrong, man? Oh. So, do you only eat chicken then? What? 
Do you only eat chicken, like as a meat? Yeah. Chicken and fish. Fair. I like fish. And I'm not. Uh, I'm starting to feel guilty when I'm eating it. Now we're talking about it. <laughs> no, I do. I've been, I, 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 sometimes I'm eating chicken, thinking, "Wow, that little fucking bird, who am I to eat it?" <laughs> Let's Are we, we can... monsters? Are Let's we going around the planet just eating every other part of life? Yeah. Let's make we a bow today. Let's make a bow today then. No, the boy to eat a Dutch chicken. <laughs> 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 that we will never eat meat again. Imagine okay? if we were bread just to be eaten. <laughs> well, that's what chickens are. Yeah. These days. Did you see animals being slaughtered then when he was on the farm? No, thank you. No. Oh, thank you. Thank you. No, look, she's going to scream for a donation. They don't come for nothing. Okay. Give them back. We're there for 20 minutes and rationing here. <laughs> uh, Just give me some money. Yeah. I'll give it all to the pan. You've just been hustled to death. The oldest trick in the booth. You're taking it off like she's giving it to you. Who's that? 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 Oh, thank you. Look, she snatched one. Look, snatched them back. Look. Wasn't <laughs> <laughs> enough. Did she have fucking snatched them a bit? Yeah, that's mad. That. We didn't meet her price. Yeah. How much did you give her? I gave her two fifty or something. <laughs> <laughs> Shit, mate, you've been well, hustled. You got jacked. Nah, she just does it with everyone, doesn't she? She does it with everyone, I bet you. Yeah. That's the bustle, isn't it? That's the first hustle I've seen in London. Yeah, today. Where was she from? Romania or something? Looks like it. Yeah. They're only doing a thing, aren't they, at the end of the day, trying to make a fucking bit of mouth, bit I of think job. she was okay. pissed off you through, through the money, I'm not fucking surprised. <laughs> I time not that, by the way. What? <laughs> yeah, you launched that out of here, lads. That was like, it. Yeah, well, it was a quid at least, wasn't it? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I should have been happy if it was a quid. <laughs> you would have been happy if it was a quid. I'm joking now. <laughs> it hit it like a bullet, though, didn't it? It's not like, it's not like it flipped it out, is it? I just spit my water. Fucking <laughs> launched it out of Bang! I <laughs> spit my water. And she had a baby with her. She only wanted some food for the baby, all bouncing 20 pence off her head. <laughs> everyone's going sick around the table, but me. It's happening here, everyone's laughing. Are you okay? Have you oh, just man. started to hide from the camera then? The water coming no, out of my I'm nose I'm and everything. It. Make sure it, everyone's in. Oh, sure, I've got some snot on this then. <laughs> I'm sure it was sticking clean to it's it. It's not a <laughs> <laughs> Oh shit, man. <laughs> Calm down. Have you spoke to Joe recently? Mm -hmm. uh, I'm just getting him because I haven't seen him on the No, I haven't, no. <laughs> no. Oh, Happy Christmas. Yeah, he sent me some audio files, basically. They just sent them through the same messages. <laughs> there you go. Hi, mate. Yeah. <laughs> is he still working that raft bloke? Right. Yeah, he probably is. Nice one, mate. Thank you. Mmm. Well, he brought them at the wrong time, hasn't he? Oh, yeah. Hopkins everywhere. <laughs> <laughs> so what are you doing Christmas Day, Darren? I haven't got a clue yet, mate. Uh -huh. Probably be by myself. But not by myself in... I'm happy by myself on Christmas Day. Yeah. Do you understand what I mean? I quite like my own company, but only for like three, four days. And then I get cabin fever. But I have to like go somewhere and get away or... But there's always, there's always something to do on Christmas 
If we're locked down, I'll just be on my live with everyone and all, all my people. I'll join you on there. Well, that's what I'm saying. I'll just be yeah. on there, keeping everyone happy, entertained. Get a few raffles going. Raffle me bike from last year and get a new one from this year. That's a good idea. There's loads of things you can do to interact with the people that cool, appreciate yeah. you. Yeah. And being honest and true is the first. Mm -hmm. That's the first thing people want from you, honestly. Exactly. That's a big family, isn't it? <laughs> Boss, that way, they're all sat down that table. Oh, yeah, yeah. It's Saturday night, isn't it? <laughs> Yeah, you two are going to do a live later. Looks like it, it, yeah. <laughs> I'll be able to watch it. I'm in mental. Maybe you have an only night. <laughs> 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 and do a live off mine. Mind you all doing your live. Webcam. Have you got a webcam? Is it on his phone? I've just got my phone. Yeah. Just position it. Next just put it on camera. the stand have next to in, his. Yeah, yeah. Have you been in this I'll have all mine donating and then, and then Sean will have his donating. I've got some like hospitality down there for Karen, like uh, some nice nibbles or something. <laughs> but you've got fruit, that is it. Just came over and smoked some weed. <laughs> <laughs> fruit nuts at the squirrels. <laughs> yeah, we all do that. I threw a whole chicken at the um, deers recently, didn't I? Cooked. How raw? Apparently they like it. Oh, they prefer that's it raw. Sean's opinion, anyway. I suppose like, <laughs> that's how they have it normally, isn't it? I know. So what are you going to do? Christmas Eve, you're going to cook them a turkey and shut that out? What the fuck? Yeah. Just get a raw turkey. <laughs> Bam. Fox will run down before the badger. Get it into the woods. And then you'll hear all the howling as the badgers try and get it off the fox. You can't say like oh, this, wouldn't it? It's a whole turkey. Christmas Day, James. Do you go around like you and your missus' family? No, we're having people over to ours. How many? Um, father in law yes. and um, um, brother in law and sister in law and their kids. I just do have like little kids, uh, like eight year olds. No, 11 to 2 or 3. So, like, you're quite young children. Yeah. Proper busy. Oh, no, 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 no. And uh, yeah, just, good luck with that. Yeah. Have you got your turkey already then? On order, yeah. We, we've got one of those yeah. half crowns turkeys, oh, so not right. the whole thing, just the, the top bit. It's easier to cook then. Oh, definitely. Because I mean, like, my grandmother gets up at stupid of that to do like turkey. To prepare yeah. What are you, you doing like for Christmas? Probably go back to Wiltshire. Right. Yeah, see my mum and uh, my grandpa Morris dances. Oh, so, right. in the Christmas Village night. Green. We've like made welly wanging and stuff like that. Right. So we're we'll doing that. It's good knees up. Um, oh, yeah. They like Morris starts around the whole village. Is that a traditional thing for Christmas? Every year they do it. Well, it's on Boxing Day they do that. Yeah. On yeah. Christmas Day, um, it would just be all family, and then Boxing Day will be welly Morris wanging, chucking wellies across the village. Yeah. Are you, are you um, a seasoned Morris dancer? <laughs> no, the women are club dancers or maypole dancers. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Mm. <laughs> I've never done it. <laughs> Uh. Maypole dancers. Mm. What are you doing, Sean? Wish I was doing maypole dancing. How do you do that? You hold on to something. <laughs> the the merry-go-round, isn't it? The merry-go-round. No, no, no. Those different ribbons around a pole and all sort of dance around it. Like the ribbon. And they all skip around it. Yeah. And like do, do a little jig. So, very folky. <laughs> Good fun. Oh, what, was the, what was the other type of dancing? Clog dancing. Clog dancing. Clogs. You got clogs? No. I've got crocs. <laughs> you haven't seen my new crocs, have you? James, they're wicked, aren't they? The white yeah. ones. With the, With the strawberries on? Yeah, all over them. And they're furry as well. <laughs> they're like everything in one. I'd be so jealous. <laughs> Me and my crocs. What are you doing for Christmas, Sean? My mum and dad are coming down from the north. Yeah. So my sister's in, in Essex. Oh, whereabouts in Essex? Let's not say. Oh, oh we're on camera. Um, right. But 
It'll be nice because the whole family will be there. My, you know, my sister's got two kids. Yeah. And a new fella said he's going to beat me at chess. So we'll see how that goes down. This is the first time you meet him. No, I met him three times. Yeah. And he's going to challenge you to chess. I have to use my prison techniques. Is that what you learned, Jay? Whatever you should do, and consider the thousands and millions of kids around the world who haven't got a parent. Mm -hmm. I want to do that shoebox appeal. You know, you send it off. Send off like two brushes and stuff, two clothes. Yeah. Boy. Nice, that's Sean. Thanks, mate. Isn't it tasty? It's good, isn't it? Good call by James to come down here. Yeah. Yeah. No, no, it's area. I've been so long to get us fucking here, then, lad. Yeah. That's detour after fucking detour across main roads under bridges. Yeah, we like, exactly the the well, we got we here. Got in we got here in the end, yeah. Just took a detour. Scenic route. Yeah. Yeah. Road. Where's the station? Um, five minute walk, that way. We didn't come this far up when we were filming here, did we? Yeah, we were further down. Oh, yeah, yeah. Oh, but um, yeah. maybe like a 40 minute walk, just straight, I'm straight things. ahead. What, what? Instead of hearing things? Yeah. What, what things? It's a long road, this one. Just little things you wouldn't understand, Sean. Mm. I think Jenny would. What will you do? It's never mind, things. it's a secret. Don't tell us, Sean. <laughs> I always hear things. You always get what? No, I don't. Start. Do you talk to yourself? Do I talk to myself? Like when you walk around house, I'm like, oh yeah, grass will get with this. Sometimes your thoughts just get verbalised, don't yeah. they? Do you talk to yourself? Sometimes I'm looking at the house. I'm in a oh, I can, I can speak out loud. I'll be like, oh, Jeff. I can, I can say something like, <laughs> yeah. I can put the phone down and go, what a fucking tit head she was. There you go, you talk to yourself, side of madness. We're all mad. It's not that, you are no. mad when you're having a conversation with yourself. When you're preaching to yourself, it's okay. When you start having a conversation with yourself, you're mad. What, like? So. Darren, what the fuck have you done? That's preaching to yourself. But if you go, Darren, what the fuck have you done? And then you go, I don't know, I fucked up bad there, aren't I, lad? <laughs> Yeah. Then you're mad. I love it. That's what you say. What do you reckon, James? Seeing you speaking to your lot of self. Do you speak to yourself, your, uh, to yourself a lot? Uh, so I've seen you when there, I'm driving. I'm... I might do. <laughs> when you're driving? Shouting it. I'm out of a driver. <laughs> Road rage. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Um, there she is again. Look round two. No. Oh, this is sister. Oh, no. no. <laughs> Oh, we get to save somebody else. Would you like some bread? Some bread? Oh. Would you like some bread? Oh. Would you like some bread? Bread, bread, bread. Oh, sorry. Move along, move along. We haven't got a pound, love. We just, we just don't get into it. Next, next level. <laughs> next level. That is next level. That, that's aggressive. Bumming. That's aggressive, bumming. Do you get that in Liverpool? Yeah. A lot. Yeah. There's a thing now, don't you label like there's begging and then there's aggressive begging, yeah. isn't it? Is it's that what it's called? Too pushy, because well, when you see like a big issue selling, you normally don't say anything, you're just standing with a big issue, so like the girl outside the shop, I give her money every time. But sometimes I don't buy a big issue, sometimes I actually do because I actually want to read it. Well why would you buy a big issue? They're actually quite entertaining. They're a bit like I like right, quite but a bit how much how well. much does the how much does the sell again? Oh, they've gone up. They're like three quid now. About three pounds. Oh, so pounds. the fella that, that's in the street selling it gets how much? I don't know. I don't know the odds on that one. But I, I think it's a room for the night Might as well. Good. Good.
£20 pound, but you can go and get an FHM or a GQ or something similar. Why do you want to go and get fucking... Yeah, you've got that good term, you're giving back to the homeless, you're helping the homeless, but... Yeah. Really? Not good writers, right for it. Would it, not be, would it not be better just giving the, the, the fella three pounds to put in his pocket? I do sometimes. Instead of going give us a magazine, just go put it in your pocket, yeah. keep your magazine. So you can sell it on again, is what you're saying. I don't know. Just, well, that's what, because when I do buy them, if I do generally want to read them, I'll take it, but sometimes I don't. I'm just, I've, well, I've probably passed them four times that week, so I don't want to buy the same magazine. Yeah. So I just yeah. money. Well, is it every month that it comes out? I think it's monthly. I think it's just all bullshit. I don't know why you've got to have fucking people who are homeless on the streets selling magazines to feed themselves. I don't know why you've got to have people on the streets who have got crazy addictions. If they don't get that first hit in the morning, they suffer like fuck until they get the hit. People won't give them money because they think it's all going on drugs. Yeah, no, once you've got real bad addictions, they've got to Once you've got that bad addiction... Yeah. So feed their habit. But, the, but with, with any, anyone who's got an addiction who's living on the streets, if you're freezing to death if you don't get that hit in the morning. Yeah. You know, your immune system's battling crazy stuff, so you need that hit to get you through these conditions. Yeah? Yeah. But people always look down on them and go, I'm not giving him money, you've got to go suspended on drugs. Without that first hit, that kid could die in the middle of the day. Yeah. You understand what I mean? Yeah. Due to his rattle. Yeah. yeah. And that's where it's just fucked. I've filmed not... a couple of people that were two twins who were addicts who were homeless around this area. And they, they said they funded it, they were just like hustling all the time, shoplifting, trying to ticket tout places. And they well, that's yeah, what spent it 600 quid a day packing heroin. It's not only that though, is it? They've got to get out, do the robbery or do the whatever they do to get the first initial funds and you've got to wait for the dealer be treated like a cunt off the dealer then go and have his hit and then he's set up for the day probably have a shot to eat but then he's got to maintain that then continuously they both said uh, they did it to like, take, just take away the pain because that was the main thing they needed to do the numbness like, in yeah. the mind and physically when you're on the streets there's a lot of there's a lot of fucking you pick up skin diseases that scab and crack and you know all mad little things like feet yeah your feet get ruined especially in this weather it's like a have killer that, risk there's, there's a charity that's going to make it recycling this packets into a blanket i don't think it's a but this is what I'm saying. What? Stuff like that. Right. Yeah. I know, but what I keep on saying, what I keep yeah. on meaning by that, it's all bullshit. All right, then. So you're gonna use all that plastic, make a make a blanket, give it to him, and he's gonna use it for 24 hours and leave it in the corner of the road, Just left in a pile. So all the blankets that are getting issued, they get used three or four times and left. You should just be getting all these empty buildings that you've got in every single city centre. This is that street in Liverpool, isn't there? What? That, there was, when I went to the uh, Grand National, there was a, we drove past the street, all the houses are boarded up and empty. Can't remember the name of it. Me. Why, uh, why aren't you just... Are you okay to check the app to see if it does uh, if it's free after six? Yes. Thanks. You know what, you know when I've spoke, spoke to homeless people all, and, and they get up, they get the support, you get boss accommodation, but it's the loneliness. So, on the streets, they've got interaction, they're communicating with someone continuously. It doesn't matter what communication it is, they're interacting with other human life. When they get the accommodation, they go in a room and then they're just locked off in this room, isolated, no interaction, no communication with anyone, and the majority of them end up back on the streets because they're lonely. Right. On the street, we've got the interaction, right. they're speaking to people, when they go in there, they're just locked. Yeah, yeah. I suppose that they're, they're just thinking about what's happened to them, and that sort of sets them off from all sorts of Imagine living 
in this environment, round the clock, the rough conditions, the noise levels, the traffic yeah. levels, yeah. the amount of people engaging with you, it doesn't matter, and then all of a sudden cutting it off. Yeah. No noise, no people interacting with you, you're just like bang, and then you've got to start addressing yourself, and that's what we can act, addressing the, addressing the trauma within, and you can only do that with a clear head, can't you? And then, if they're in a bad situation where they don't see a way so to move it. forward, they use your option. Suicide. Suicide. Or, or, so go back oh, yeah, we should get going. Same in, back to addictions, or yes. Okay. Like I said, the majority I speak to, they end up back on the streets because Let's of that, that lonely, lonely factor. So, do you think they just the loneliness brings dark places? So, do you think they need some guidance? So, when they are. How yeah, they, they shouldn't just be left there. Yeah. They, yeah, so they, what, they, what the council are doing is to, to, to create the figures that they need to look like a good council for the homelessness. Yeah. They're happy with just going, there's a room, see you later. Yeah. Do you understand? Yeah. Instead of stepping in, knowing quite yeah, well, it's a lot more than just giving someone a room once they've been homeless. Yeah. yeah. People can't function. I used to work volunteer oh for crisis, you know, homeless charity. Yeah, yeah, I did it. I did it. I did it. Yeah, so crisis skylight. I used to teach filmmaking there for a while, and a lot of people said they'd get accommodation in their rent to someone else, go on streets, because then they'd get the rent money themselves. Yeah, yeah. They said they were happier. Sure. Yeah, like money. ghost renting. Yeah, so there's enough rampant speculation. Some people were even happy living on the streets, saying they'd been married, had kids, and respectable life, and and they were more happy being living on the streets instead of being with the families. Yeah. Yeah. And that guy who said that is an alcoholic. Well, that's what anyone anyone with addiction forms a streak of selfishness. Alan, you alright mate, yeah? Yeah, man. We're gonna have to get going in a minute, James, because we're running out of uh, time on the meeting. Do you understand what I mean? Yeah, yeah. Like, when you've got an addiction... So, can I have a bit of promise, sir? Yeah, when, yeah, when, 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 when you've got an addiction, yes. nothing matters, does it? Except the addiction. Yeah. Everything, can, everything comes second class to the addiction. Yeah. I've enjoyed my time down here, in London, delivering a message. So, where have I been? Birmingham, Milton Keynes, Liverpool in the next few days, London. That's four places off the flyer done. I've got four more places to go before Christmas and New Year.